why all fans have been left emotional after noticing Queen Elizabeth with tears in her eyes at her late husband Prince Philip's emotional memorial at Westminster Abbey, on Tuesday the 29th of March. Her Majesty has been praised for her composure and strength despite mobility and health issues. On today, the Queen paid a special tribute to her late husband Prince Philip's memorial service by sporting a brooch he gifted her in 1966. Dressed in a green ensemble, the monarch, 95, donned the green ruby brooch, which was a personal gift to her from her husband. The dark green hue is the color of Prince Philip's official livery. Known as Edinburgh Green, it has been used for staff uniforms and private cars. A green Land Rover was also used to carry Prince Philip's coffin at his funeral last April. Queen Elizabeth, 95, was escorted into the venue by her son Prince Andrew, 62, as she paid tribute to her husband Philip, who died aged 99 on the 9th of April 2021. Her Majesty stood in Westminster Abbey where she had personally ensured her beloved husband's final wishes were fulfilled after his covid hit funeral left her sat alone without the rousing hymns and guests he loved so much. Despite battling mobility problems, she stood to pray and sing anthems during a 40-minute ceremony which Philip, her husband of 93 years, had helped plan before his death last April. As God Save the Queen played and hundreds around her sang. The queen grabbed a tissue and wiped away tears from her eyes. It did not go unnoticed by fans, who flocked to Twitter to share how emotional they felt at watching the scene. The queen has tears in her eyes, one person wrote with teary-eyed emojis. Another said, oh, I had sudden tears watching the queen as the national anthem was sung in Westminster Abbey just now. But her smile is still so beautiful. Green must have been Prince Philip's favorite color. One wrote, she looks superb. Delighted to see her at the ceremony. The queen is an example to us all. While a third added, good to see the queen attending. She's a strong woman. Another said, oh no. I don't think I've ever seen the queen look so emotional as she did just then during God Save the Queen. She had tears in her eyes. I'm far from a royalist. But that was clearly a widow having a moment of grief Prince Philip. The Queen isn't the only one who shed a tear at the service of Thanksgiving as her grandchild Princess Beatrice, 33, also had a moment. The 33-year-old could be seen standing next to her cousin Prince William, 39, and her sister Princess Eugenie, 32, as she put her hand up to her face to wipe away tears during the memorial. Beatrice arrived at the service with her husband Eduardo Mapelli Mozzi, 38, and the pair opted to leave their daughter Sienna at home. The Queen used a stick as she was walked to her seat by her disgraced son the Duke of York to give her strength and stay Philip the final farewell he had wanted. But in a controversial decision she chose Prince Andrew to support her as she arrived and left the church, clutching his elbow with one hand and a walking stick with the other. The Duke of Edinburgh was described as a devoted consort to the Queen as the royal family's official Instagram page shared a touching photo montage dedicated to his extraordinary life today. Some 1,800 guests, including senior members of the royal family, are expected to attend a service of thanksgiving for Prince Philip this morning at Westminster Abbey. Ahead of the event, which will be aired from 10.30 on BBC One. The royal family's official Instagram page shared a short photo montage dedicated to the late Duke's life. Her Majesty was actively involved in every element of the service of Thanksgiving which Westminster Abbey packed to the rafters. Even the smallest of touches were overseen by the Queen, including the use of orchids that formed part of her 1947 wedding bouquet being used in small poses of flowers. Thank you for watching our latest video about the royal family. We always try to regularly update the latest news videos about the British royal family to meet your requirements. Our channel always has an objective, multi-dimensional view of the news. My main goal is just to entertain people. Hope you enjoy this news. If you have any questions or requests about content to watch, please leave a comment below this video of us.